lines. I'm here to help you in understanding uses of radio wise type in medicine or industry. I've chosen to base on cobalt 60 diamond gamma rays. The radio wise type is cobalt 60 and it holds an unstable nucleus that emits radiation during its decay to a balanced form. The radiation it emits is a nuclear radiation called gamma rays, which are part of the electromagnetic spectrum. They hold the highest energy but the shortest wavelength. Its nature is known as electromagnetic radiation. This radioactive has many applications, some being in medicine or industry. In medicine, cobalt 60 is put to use as a foundation for radio or radiation therapy that eliminates cancer cells. It carries a half-life of 5.27 years, which is the time taken for half the radioactive atoms to decay. This radiation therapy gives high amounts of gamma radiation to a tumor that decreases damage to surrounding organs. This is the best treatment for cancers because its delivery is fast, which gives off approximately 200 beams of gamma radioactivity. The process takes minutes to hours with the patient able to return to normal day plans. There are many benefits for using cobalt 60. These include the fact that cobalt 60 therapy is painless. It removes cancer cells. It decreases damage to vital organs that are surrounding the targeted tumor. It's a fast session that helps with treating cancer and the patient can return to normal plans. Despite what follows, there are problems with the use of cobalt because of high absorption. Inhaling too much will affect our lungs, causing asthma, but this mainly happens to the workers. Some other health problems caused by high concentrations include vomiting or nausea, vision, heart, and thyroid problems. Both the first can be caused by the radiation or radioactive co cobalt isotopes. Some may be hair loss, bleeding, coma, and even death, while simple exposure to cobalt can cause weight loss, dermatitis, or respiratory hypersensitivity. Also, gamma rays are the most dangerous and penetrating, so they can cause damage to tissues. Because cobalt-60 is an ionizing radiation, it can increase the risk of cancer because it emits solid gamma rays. However, the seriousness of the problem relies on how much cobalt is being exposed. Take in mind of the length of exposure, the distance from the source, and whether it was consumed or inhaled. The benefits easily outweigh the problems, even though there are many. This is because the problems are very unlikely, and you can find out if you are at risk, so it's preventive. Mainly workers and people who have absorbed high concentrations are targets, and unless you complete certain medical treatments, you are very unlikely to face cobalt 60, but you may accidentally meet a radiation source containing the radioisotope. So here are the benefits on top. Some tests can measure the amount of cobalt 60 in your urine. Also, there is a technique called whole body counting, which finds gamma radiation emitted by cobalt 60 in the body. Sadly, it's time to end. I hope I have deepened your knowledge about cobalt 60 